This is Bishop John Durfler of the Diocese of Marquette. I have long been a fan of the science fiction genre. I grew up on Star Trek and Star Wars, and 2001 A Space Odyssey is one of my favorites. The theme of time travel appears frequently in science fiction works. Is it possible to travel to the future or the past? Yes, it is. Hope makes the future present. In my last message on our mystery tour, we reflected on the virtue of faith. In this message, I would like to reflect upon the virtue of hope. Hope, along with faith and charity, are called theological virtues because these virtues help us to direct our life to God. The Greek word for God is theos, and it is one of the roots of the word theological. The Catechism of the Catholic Church states that hope is the theological virtue by which we desire the kingdom of heaven and eternal life as our happiness, placing our trust in Christ's promises and relying not on our own strength, but on the grace of the Holy Spirit. End of quote. We face many obstacles in life, and it is easy to become discouraged. Hope gives us strength and encouragement in the midst of present struggles in life. How does hope do this? Through the grace of God, we are able to live the future in the present. Through the virtue of hope, we are so filled with the love of God that we are confident in the future that awaits us, a future of happiness in union with God. Hope is a form of time travel, we might say. Through hope, our future happiness with God in the eternal life of heaven is present to us now to help us live in the midst of the struggles in the present life. St. Paul says in the letter to the Romans, Hope does not disappoint because of the love of God has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit that has been given us. Similarly, Pope Benedict says, in the same vein, he says to the Thessalonians, you must not grieve as others do who have no hope. Here too, we see a distinguishing mark of Christians, the fact that they have a future. It is not that they know the details of what awaits them, but they know in general terms that their life will not end in emptiness. Only when the future is certain as a positive reality does it become possible to live the present as well. That means the gospel is not merely a communication of things that can be known. It is one that makes things happen and is life-changing. The dark door of time, of the future, has been thrown open. The one who has hope lives differently. The one who hopes has been granted the gift of a new life. End of quote. This is Bishop John Durfler of the Diocese of Marquette.